What's up guys, it's Nikki with Eat, Try, Unbox, and today we're gonna be trying a recipe that we saw on Facebook. Basically, there's this video of this guy making horchata, and I was like, well, you know what? I have all the ingredients that he had in his video. Why not make it myself? All right, so he didn't have any measurements in that video, so it looked like one cup of rice, a whole thing of water, and then a few cinnamon sticks. I don't have any bowls to use, so we're just gonna use this container. Rice. His measuring cup looked like two cups of water, so we're gonna do two cups of water. He put like no instructions of like how much to use and I'm just winging it. So I went to look for a recipe online instead. In here, I have a cup of rice, five cinnamon sticks and some almonds and we're gonna let it soak for five hours. All right, so you're supposed to leave it in for either five hours or overnight. It has been eight hours. It's quite soft. On to the next step. What? All right, at this point, I'm following two different horchata recipes. I don't know really what I'm doing. I'm just hoping it's gonna taste good. So we're supposed to strain all the ingredients out, the rice, the almonds, and the cinnamon sticks. Strained. Okay, Oops. honestly, I feel like a hot mess because I am, I think I'm watching like three different videos and an article on what I'm supposed to be doing. Uh, hopefully I'm doing this right. We're doing a tablespoon of vanilla extract. And like one guy did a video using these chocolate uh, abuelita or this one is Ibarra chocolates. And that's why like I did his video because I wanted to use these chocolates but then nobody else is using it. So I'm like, do I use it or do I not? So we'll see. Let's add some water. This is definitely cinnamony. I want to say it's reminding me of big red gum. Uh, yeah. Let's add the chocolate. Do I know if it's necessary? No. Did all the other recipes do it? No. Did one recipe do it? Yeah. What's it? Maybe if I just... Okay, there we go. He also puts a cup of sugar, so let's do that. So I don't have regular sugar, I just have organic sugar, so I hope that's fine. But also, one cup of sugar is a lot of freaking sugar, man. Look at this. Jesus Christ. It says for one and a half cups of milk, so... I don't know if there's gonna be enough space for this. I'm obviously not confident in my pouring abilities. Okay, there's one. All right, time to blend. Something happened. Um, I don't know if that was supposed to happen. Let's try that again. Maybe it wasn't tight enough. I don't know, we'll see. <laughs> Is that supposed to happen? We're letting that strain out into here. I feel like if I stir it, it'll make it go faster. So look at all that stir. Right, so this is what I got. Time to do a taste test. I figured the best way to do a taste test is just straight from the bowl because if I pour it in a cup, I might need to add more. And if I'm gonna add more in a cup, I might as well add more in the whole thing. Does that make sense? Let's try it. Maybe I need ice. All right, so let's put it in some ice and give it another taste. Cheers. <clears throat> I think the texture is right. I think it's a little too cinnamony. 
but I don't know how many I was supposed to put in. I just threw a bunch of sticks in there. It smells like big red. That's what I said. It's a little strong. In the cinnamon flavor, right? Yeah, it needs to, I think you need more milk to dumb it down. All right, so let's go add more milk then. Maybe I should put more. What do you think? Yeah, I think adding more milk makes it a little bit more better. Maybe more chocolate. I don't know, man. Maybe more sugar? still missing something. I don't know. It kinda has like a chalky consistency. And some weird flavor, I don't know. It has like a weird flavor, I can't place it. But I think it's just too much cinnamon. So I have to drink it anyway because I'm not gonna let it go to waste. But I'm a little bummed that, uh, I think it's my fault. I was following like three, four different recipes, uh, and I didn't know which one I should really, really stick to. I mean, even though I followed different recipes, um, they were all fairly the same. I think my biggest problem was I threw in like five or six cinnamon sticks, and I don't think that everybody else put that much. So I'm gonna drink it anyway. Have you guys made horchata? Please let me know a recipe that you like and that works well for you so that I can try it and make mine better. Leave a comment down below and help a girl out. Thank you, bye.